We are going to review how to print with your Robo C2 or Robo R2 smart 3D printer with Wi-Fi using a Microsoft Surface tablet. Keep in mind that the process we'll go through is the same for both Robo C2 and Robo R2 printers. Okay, let's get started. Make sure your Robo 3D printer and your Microsoft tablet are connected to the same Wi-Fi network. Whether you're printing a downloaded file or one that you've personally designed, the following steps will get you up and making fast. To print a downloaded file, go to the 3D Marketplace and find the file you want to print. Then, download the file. You always have the option to print via USB or Wi-Fi. If you want to print via Wi-Fi, you'll need the unique IP address for your Robo 3D printer. You can find the IP address by going to the touchscreen on your printer and selecting Utilities, Network, then Network Status. Now open another tab in your browser and type in the IP address. The printer should immediately connect to the Robo OctoPrint server. Now upload the file into the OctoPrint software. The slicing profiles will automatically open after the file has finished uploading. Go ahead and select your desired settings. And remember, you can always opt to start your print after your file is done slicing. To complete this step, select Slice. The file will now be sent to your Robo C2 or Robo R2 and begin printing. Once the print is complete, safely remove it from your Robo 3D printer and you're all set. If you opt to create your own design, using Microsoft 3D Builder is a great way to fine tune your 3D model before you print it from your Robo 3D printer. If you ever have any questions or need help with Robo C2 or Robo R2, our industry leading customer service team is always available, day or night. Contact us by phone or email. Thanks for watching. And as always, happy making.